Hey there. All right, Spider's Web, London Namath, five minute practice, 92. I did go and find the other two videos <laughs> of this song and it sounds pretty much what it, what I'm doing. The, the thing I was trying to focus on is, you know, what does this sound like? What do other people do for this? And it sounds pretty close to this. Of course it was more consistent. what they put up. Um, anyway. I think I'm playing it too loud. No, that was too short. So I don't know. I, do, do you hear the musicality yet? I don't. So when I focus on playing quiet, I end up playing too slow. It's still got to be very quick, even if I want it to be quiet. Because it is piano all the way through until the very last chord, which is mezzo forte, but all the way through piano, both hands, and without the click, you can hear it ring a little bit longer, so that's helpful. that's supposed to be a, like a scare jump, a cut jump, or whatever. I don't know. Slowly with suspense. I, I don't think I have the skill. <laughs> I still want this to be, I think I'm, at, I'm kind of in the mindset that these last five songs, because the two I'm working on now, and then three more, and I am not looking forward to the last one, Thunderstorm, because it's not written as traditional music. You're given three segments of music that you can play however you want to play, whatever order, whatever speed, whatever dynamics, so it's kind of, uh, it'll be something that'll push me to be creative and <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, I'm really not creative. I'm really not. So it's not, I'm not ever going to start writing music here at the piano. My, my only goal is to play music that's already made. Really, that's it. And there 
it is. Another day done of Spider's Web by Linda Namath. Hey, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a great day. Hoorah.